Hey, hi, hello, welcome back to my new video. This is Sampath. You are watching Sampath Sam FX YouTube channel, and this is Poco X3 custom ROM reviews. You can see here finally the wait is over. The mint version 13.0.1 stable version available for Poco X3, even it is usable for X3 NFC2. You can see here the version is 13.0.1, and if you go into all specs here, you can read everything. And Android version is 12 and security patch is July 1. And kernel used here is 4.14.190. Surya Puff kernel has been used. This is very good ROM. In fact, I am going to test all these games. You can see here Free Fire Max, Call of Duty, Apex Legends, Battlegrounds Mobile India, and New State Mobile. I think I have covered every game here. Stay tuned till the end of the video and let's begin this video. In this video, I am starting with the CPU throttling test. You can see here I run for just 3 minutes, 4 seconds, and 5 milliseconds. The maximum you can see here 166 and average is 157 and minimum is 131 million GPS. At least 5 mm minimum is minute is necessary for CPU throttling analysis. It says because of time running out, actually I need to install the ROM and I have to install all the games. Those are very heavy games. It's already late since I am cutting off for 3 minutes. It's actually very good. I don't believe in this app results but still if you want to check out you can see and just for 3 minutes basic thing you can check out and this is the turbo watt charging support is available. I will also show you live also. Wait a second. You can see the always on display is also working fine and even the turbo charging. It's very quick to charge your smartphone. Poco XC NFC and face unlock you can see here it's very quick to unlock your smartphone using this particular ROM even the fingerprint unlock let me show you this is face unlock as you can see it's very very quick by using the fingerprint unlock also okay you need to press it as of now you can change in the settings I will show you a while within a second about that and you can see here this is the dialer let me increase a little bit of volume here and big surprise for me is the haptic feedback whenever you use the volume panel you will get a haptic feedback that's really good and you can see here call recording feature is also available in this particular ROM this is a very good ROM I was waiting for this particular ROM for especially for Boko X3 device this is a very very good ROM available now moving into settings you can see here this is basic settings previously I already explained about MIUI URAM you can see that video exactly the same just I will show you this wallpaper and personalization you get plenty of wallpapers live wallpapers and plenty of MIUI 13 wallpapers and more system wallpapers you can check out here and biggest thing different from that is the always on display and notification effect you can check out from here I will show you the always on display it's very much usable as you can see the always on display is working fine this is the only ROM I can say every feature is working as good as MIUI stock ROM but with many features and very good gaming stability I mean the high performance ROM in the security let me add the games in game turbo mode I haven't used it as of now toolbox you can see plenty of options are available go to game turbo it's in horizontal as of now okay there is only call of duty added let me add some of their games you can add battlegrounds mobile india pubg new state free fire max apex legends these things i have been added where are the other games okay like this you need to swipe as you can see this is the gaming mode available in this particular rom which game i need to start first let me start with the apex legends start playing you can see here the graphics is set to smooth plus very high i mean the frames here and i try to play match and haptic feedback is very very good in this particular rom and biggest thing you know mio mint is famous for its loudness using this stereo speakers it's very very loud trust me when i say this word it's very very loud in this particular rom and gaming game turbo you will get 
new and a 12 style only and you get this sidebar or tab plus whatever it is and watch changer is available and keep it this one whatever you like i like this bright and saturated and as of now my level is low hence i am using this chair park type mode here i don't know how to play i asked in the previous key rom also mu you you did not responded for that at least in the game you can respond me it's fine apex legends are fine here i don't know really how it handles in battleground game i need to update this level i had no time to play this game for a long time then i can update i mean update my level in this game now i'll come back and show you some other games like now i'll start with free fire max you can see here into the settings if i go where to find the graphics i don't know you guys can have a look on that visual effects classic dark no blood there is no separate settings for graphics here and brightness is also very good in this particular room you can see it's 80 percent now this are the free fire max gameplay you can check out live here live gameplay and by the way which game you going to play in poco x3 slash nfc you can comment down below i'll also add a poll participate in that because of you guys i am adding each and every game here you request some other games but i thought why not i add this game also all the battle royal games have been added it's fine very smooth in my opinion i set refresh it to 120 hertz let me show you with this car also as you can see it's so quick how to drive this car okay you can see the loudness how loud it is and how smooth the gameplay is this is the beauty of MIUI Mint version for POCO X and biggest thing is Android 12 based MIUI 13 this is now we will start with Call of Duty I know most of them are waiting for Battlegrounds Mobile India I will show you you can see here this call of duty and graphic settings whatever you get you can check out here low set to quality and frame rate is max and loudness as i said before also it's very very loud and smoothness in the ui is next level you will notice the difference i frequently change the roms hence i can notice the difference very soon for you it might take some time to get adjust with this rom but it's very good rom no need to think twice or thrice just flash the rom it's very easy i initially flashed 12.5.8.0 firmware that you need to keep in mind later rom zip file and format data and reboot to system you can see how smooth the UI and this is the game turbo mode you can take the screenshot from here and vibration feedback is very good as I said before too you can see graphics is also very good if you can't if you want to show off you can keep high graphics the frame rate will be reduced at that time if you want to play very good battle roll then keep the frames high and graphics level to low i'll come back this is very good 
you need to play some more time but i don't have time now let's see the battlegrounds mobile india hit that like button guys if you're first time to this channel hit that subscribe button also and also allow the bell notification by pressing the bell icon whenever i make a new video you'll get notified And biggest downside for me is like smooth plus ultra only here IFPS count by default has not been enabled here but you can enable if you know how to enable the IFPS count as of now this game is not available in the play store I just downloaded it because many people need it I understand your need hence I'm making it and let me drop down here in Asna Poliana that yellow region more loot and most of them will drop there let's see how it handles in 40 fps definitely they would have been added that 90 fps option that was the big change compared to any other MIUI ROMs before but why they did that I don't know it was better if it was with 90 fps by default but anyhow people know how to enable 90 fps easily that's the one thing the change but still it's playable this is the beauty here you get a lot more loot let's check this guy I don't have helmet also let's see well I can take him with 40 fps that's how it is the BGMI is also fine but just we are missing 90 fps option here and I'll show you the PUBG new state also that's my personal favorite game but still I am not playing that game too as of now I had no time making your videos is definitely possible because of that only this channel is meant for I definitely do that for that no compromise maybe he was bought someone it's fine here definitely you can play the games with 40 fps too i thought man it's 40 fps i would have killed very soon but still it's very good gaming rom the movement and biggest thing as i said stereo speakers loudness is very good in this rom as usual okay I'll come back and I will show you the P PUBG new state how it handles see the opening time it taking a little bit of time now this is the fifth game here we go this is PUBG new state in extreme mode I am in the air angle action and you can see here I kept a frame rate 90 fps and this is the real time fps count you can see it's up to 86 108 also and you get this game turbo mode voice changer i kept this settings to bright and saturated you can change that there are few customization record screenshot clear memory you can clear that but i don't do that 
because I need to show you the RAM management how it handles and you can see here kept to light and up to 90 FPS that's fine actually this is a wrangle extreme mode you also get troy extreme here okay let me follow him this is a very good game but i don't know why people stick to battlegrounds mobile india and some are moved to that apex legends i don't know how you like those games i mean it was better the battleground mobile india before when it was pubg mobile And you can see here how the graphics is and you can change here like as i said before bright now it is super bright and there is little bit of lag now this is the fifth game continuously i am playing now more than 20 minutes now i am playing the games and device is not getting warm that much that's really a good sign will i get any loot here this is ruins i guess yeah um, hope so i get any gun this game is little bit laggy not as good as many other games as i shown and you can see the fps here it's still 66 now as i said it's laggy hence it's falling the fps and you can judge how it handles the pubg new strat in this mere mint version maybe this particular game is not optimized that much but other than that every game was playable not just playable it's very good for gaming okay i'll show you the ram management now in the memory you can see here there is a battleground mobile india new state call of duty free fire max and apex legend let's see will apex legends is still in the memory no it reloaded and let's check out the next game the free fire max it's also reloaded again let's check the call of duty it's also reloaded nothing is in the memory maybe because of heavy games and battlegrounds mobile india just we played is it still in the memory no it's also booted out of the memory let's check out this new state at least yeah this is in the memory and i got killed that's how it is the ram management is not that great compared to any other roms but these are heavy games and let's check out some other application is it still in the memory or not no i haven't opened anything and coming to safety net status you can see here i'll run this it will get passed you can use all the payment applications like phone pay paytm whatever you want to use you can use that and drm info also you get level one certification as you can see that you can judge the app opening time also level one certification you can watch all the OTT application in hd resolution and whatsapp is also working fine and during calls also there is no any problem in earpiece that's fine and carrier aggregation support is there wi-fi connectivity you have seen the games how it will give the ping i have 100 mps geo geo fiber connection it's pulling up to 90 to 95 that's not the problem here and camera application little bit of ui customization you can see the font is a little bit different but all the features are same here the log mode all the things are fine here even the ultra wide angle is also working fine that's the biggest usb when i was purchasing this device the ultra wide angle was 13 megapixel even today we don't get that under that 15 16k price segment that's how it is and you can see 
safety net status and security you get all the basic things right here hope i explained everything and this is a quick setting plan there is a theme applied here you can see here let me go to settings you can see there is a theme applied here a little bit of green type and this is how the mu mint version for poco xc slash nfc coming to verdict you can use gcam port also if i had per forget to add anything let me know you can comment on in the comment section such that i can replay you whenever i say the comment and you can see here the benchmark result this is very important i forget to tell you this you can see 3,61,713 which is good enough and temperature raise was just 2.7 degrees Celsius and battery drop is 2% during this testing and Geekbench scores are very good this is the score you only get in MIUI based ROMs you never get in AOSP ROMs you can see 1801 multi score which is very good and 559 is single score which is very good in my opinion not just that you have seen the games and day-to-day -day performance this is very important if you don't play the games if you want MIUI based ROMs you can definitely try it out and the always on display and face lock fingerprint unlock everything is working fine you can see always on display is also working fine no problem regarding this ROM each and every feature is so good here that's how the conclusion I give the conclusion for your side if you want to use MIUI based ROM this is the best ROM available even better than the stock U and SR ROMs that I can guarantee you that's how the ROM is just PUBG new state had a little bit of luck yes of course if you have play more and more games for a long time this will be there and you can see the fluidity here in the recent app section also and even in the display settings also I try to show you here I kept to 120Hz as you can see that's how it is this is very good ROM you can definitely try it out as a daily leader many people waiting for that update finally it has been received. We'll meet you with another interesting video. Until that, keep smelling Baba for now.